our days basically rotates on daily tasks, online classes, and putting hours of work in front of the computer. And basically, these hours turns into days and turns into weeks. Most of the time, what's happening with us has been, shall we say, programmed. But I have to say that this week, we finally did break off. I wouldn't be honest if I had to say that I love Mondays in general. But for this week, it's totally different. It's the start of my one-week training plan for an upcoming bike race this Sunday. And it's been a while since I've done things like this. It's been a while since I felt the simple pleasure and suffering that training provides. These feelings when the road starts to blur. You feel blood in your throat. The burning legs as well as the nerves that you get. Thinking that you wouldn't get in shape on time. I've never felt this alive for a while. And one morning I get to visit a friend named Paul. I had to borrow a tool for making videos and I was glad he had one. He's into creating contents as well but he is focused most on cycling videos. I'll put his link on the descriptions down below. As they say, a clean bike is a happy bike. So we took this two-wheeled best friend of ours to a local bike shop for a bike spa. It's been a while since he had one. We took the bike into this shop of Gobert, Austria, locally known as Papago. He is one of the most well-known and respected cyclists in Agros Oriental and is very accommodating to his customers. It's always nice getting to have our repairs to a fellow cyclist because he basically knows what we feel when there is something wrong going with our bikes. And he very well fixed things efficiently. He also have a YouTube channel and a Facebook account where you can message him for your repair inquiries. I link both in the description down below. And so Wednesday came and Virgil get into his artistic mode in his creative Wednesday routine. This time he is into creating t-shirt designs, editing pictures he take and basically exploring every creative corner there is in his mind. one of those times when we get to appreciate this craftsmanship 
that's unique in him. A complex and entertaining connection between man and machine. Day finally came. Cyclists rushed into excitement, and the venue was filled with people who shared the same passion. This unique feeling of excitement and adrenaline is relative to all of us. And from then, it was not too long until race starts. Demanding climbs, mixed terrains, and a bunch of locals greeted us throughout the course. Along with exhausted lungs, burning legs, and cold sweat, it's definitely something I would suffer all over again. After all, it was a fun day, and nonetheless, I got 9th place. I'll be by your side. Most of the time, we tend to focus more on the deadlines ahead of us. We tend to get works above our head and pressure ourselves. But as long as there are these things that we enjoy doing, and keeping our passions burning, we would always find balance and work things out. 